what is happening guys? I hope you're all doing good. So today I'm here to react to the brand new Al Heightham, <laughs> Molly <Moloch> Hot Ham, <laughs> um, demo and teaser that have come out for this character. So I'm really excited to get into this. This is a new dendro, like, sword user, although dual sword users from what I've seen from the 3.4 live stream, just like, oh my god. So I'm so excited to watch these. Al Heightham is a character who is definitely very mysterious. The point that I'm at in the Zoom request at the moment, I don't know a great deal about this character, so they are definitely a mystery to me. They are extremely attractive and just all around, just, you know what I mean, that, you know, <laughs> let's just watch the teaser and demo. <laughs> So this teaser and demo is pretty much gonna hopefully make me make my decision as to whether or not I'm going to get this character or not. I'm not sure at this point whether or not I am actually going to try and pull for Al Haitham because Zhao is also on the banner. Now, the thing to know about the team that I'm aiming for at the moment is I'm currently working with a Hyper Bloom team. So currently in my main team, I've got Zhongli, which is obviously not part of the Hyper Bloom. I've got Ayato, Raiden, and Nahida. And Nahida, I'm just about to start building. However, I'm obviously at that point where like I could like not build Nahida and instead build Al Haitham if I decide to to get him. However, Nahida is really good. So Al Haitham is gonna have to have to have some like damn good skills to replace Nahida in my team as my main dendro. Oh, oh it's so the pretty. The origins of writing are lost to time and it is forbidden to investigate the genesis of language. But since their inception, so these pretty. symbols have silently recorded everything. Oh. The skies, the stars, the mountains, and the birds. <gasps> Conflict. Oh. Peace. And people from all walks of life. Oh, Durin's at all. Words are strung together and edited, history made, and archived for posterity. Oh wow! Oh, I love the style of this! The scribe records not only the truth, but the questions it leaves unanswered. Many of them will remain unanswered forever. Nah, mate, nah. That's what law videos are for, pal. Don't the even worry about it. The profoundest eternal questions are met only with a boundless and eternal silence. He's just so beautifully spoken and articulate, and it's just so gorgeous. Like, the voice actor, oh my god, they absolutely nailed it for Al Haitham. Like, the voice acting is just so good, and, like, I love how, like... He clearly is like well read. He's clearly like a researcher at heart. He wants, I mean, that's something I've wondered. We see those symbols all the time in different areas of the game. And it's interesting that that kind of gave us a little tidbit into those symbols, like what those symbols are, and that like there are people in the game that are also wondering things about them. And that's really fascinating. Like just that little like lore tidbit there. Oh my God, oh, I love this game. Oh. God, it's so good. That was beautifully done. I loved the transition when he was like going through like the library and like all the books and everything. And it clearly showed that like all this knowledge that he's like gone to obtain, like he's such a fascinating character. And I mean, A, I'm really looking forward to getting to see him more in Sumeru because like, oh, uh, and B, he's just so fucking cool. Like, I just love his vibe. It's just, yes. Okay, let us watch the demo. Where were we? Ah, uh, yes. Al Haytham told you he's a feeble scholar, did he? <laughs> well, oh! That's a bold face. Oh! I think that's the character that people keep- like, keep people- is it like, Kaveh? 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 I haven't met Kaveh yet in the quest, but people keep mentioning Kaveh and they're like, oh my god, just wait till you meet Kaveh, and I'm like, who? And now I'm just like, Hello. <laughs> uh, playable when? Playable when? Clearly gonna be playable. Hello, who are we? Love the eyes. Oh my god, the red. Gorgeous with the blonde. Stunning. Um, I'm a little bit in shock. Who are you? And also, I already love the sass that he's just sat here bitching about. Oh, I, um, I love it. He's <laughs> fly. Told you. Oh my god, he's side of the so his modesty was just a facade to hide his true abilities? I love it. Absolutely. He doesn't want others. They're playing TCG. 
God, this game is everywhere. <laughs> his true strength. Well, how strong is he? Stronger than you? Of course not. <laughs> you know, I actually ran into him last week while I was in the desert looking for creative inspiration. He was going out there to study ancient runes anyway. Why didn't he travel with me? We could have split the cost. <laughs> Oh, he's so pretty. <gasps> the dual sword wielding sends me every time. It is one of my favorite weapon styles. You do not see it in games that often, but the like, I know it's not all the time, but just when he like has the second sword, when he's doing some of his fighting moves, oh my god, it is so cool. It's so good. I love it. I absolutely love it. I can't. I'm obsessed. This is not helping me. Okay, let's continue. <laughs> Kicking weapons. Oh, we all know how much I love when people kick weapons. Zhong Li just kicks that spear with such majestic grace. Oh, it's my fave. Oh no. <laughs> this is not good. Oh no, look at this screenshot. Don't look at me, Al. Don't look. I can't. This is just, I can't. I can't cope. Flicker. Frankly, however strong oh he is God. or isn't, I just don't want to mess with him. I love it. I thought you'd have learned to think before you speak by now. <laughs> you didn't say anything bad. All positive, actually. Surely you didn't drag me out just to play cards. Okay, I like the dynamic to them too, that's fun. We were just debating how good you'd be in a fight. You keep your cards close to your chest. Not at all. So you don't fight much? Yeah, right, with his temper? <laughs> I don't need to fight. I only need to think. Ooh. Everything is connected. All oh. I have to do is find the weakest link, deal with the causal factors, and everything else tends to resolve itself. The process of elimination. Wow. Ooh. Reminds me a little bit of Elysia, that move with the with the crit and the barrier and all the lasers you know firing the lasers i like that i like that so it's, it's a good move it's very good it's that especially if that's quite a big like applicating area that's that's actually quite useful oh, this is... It's like a leaf, that's so cool. Essentially, more time on contemplation, less time on execution. Simple, isn't it? <laughs> Not really. <laughs> oh, I knew we shouldn't have brought this up with you. I thought my answer was quite engrossing. <laughs> Boss, this is good wine. I'll have the same, please. Oh my god, this dynamic with these four is amazing. I've literally just hit the point in Sumo at this point of filming this where, like, Sino and um, Al Haitham have just met, and obviously they immediately, like, ah. So, like, it's really interesting to, like, see the dynamic in this, and oh my. Oh, that is interesting. Oh, that doesn't. Oh no, that doesn't help my decision in the slightest. <laughs> So that was the Al Haytham teaser and demo. I mean, that demo was stunning. I really like the fact that I really feel like we got a good feel for the character. We got a good feel for like what matters to him. The music was really good. We got to see like a good range of the abilities. I think I'll need to like A, test out this character first and also check on some of the abilities to see how well it would work in a Hyper Bloom team because he definitely seems like more of a Dendro DPS and I don't know whether or not I think for my Hyper Bloom team I need more of a Dendro applicator. Not to say that I wouldn't get this character in the future because oh my God, so we'll get this character in the future. However, 
for my current layout of team, it's whether or not I need it. I mean, I've got my backup team, to be fair, which, you know, for the Abyss, so could always get them for that. For all these characters and stuff is obviously, like, really important, so I'm definitely gonna have to try all this character. But my god, that was... Oh my god. Seeing... I'm pretty sure that was Cave because people have mentioned Cave to me, and they're like, oh, he's something... Like, there's someone that, like, knows I'll hate him. So I think that might be Cave, and I hope I'm saying the name right. But that was really fun. I really enjoyed that. And I think they did it. They did like a great job with, with that entire thing. It was just so beautifully done. Oh man, that was so enjoyable. Oh no, my wallet is crying. <laughs> I can't wail. Don't make me wail, please. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know, are you going to go for Al Heitham? Should I go for Al Heitham? How would he work on a Hype Bloom team? Please let me know down in the comments below, you know. I'm I'm still I'm still a bebe bebe Genshin streamer. I mean, I know that I've nearly caught up, but still, I'm still a baby. I'm still learning. There's a lot for me to learn. Ooh, the world of artifacts is opening up to me at the moment. <laughs> it's 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 a pain. It's 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 a pain. Uh, <laughs> but I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Plenty more content on this channel. And if you didn't know, I'm also a Twitch streamer. So I'm currently streaming Genshin over on my Twitch channel. So if you want to come and say hi sometime and hang out while we're playing Genshin, I also do Honkai as well. That would be awesome. And yeah, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. And if there's anything else you want me to react to, leave me down in the comments below. And I will see you guys in the next video, hopefully. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day. Bye.